Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. Welcome to the third annual mini marathon here at Burr Intermediate School. It's a great day where our kids learn to give back to a great organization. This year we're sponsoring the Make-A-Wish Foundation. Well, it's basically teaching the kids fitness. They prepare for the event during their gym classes, so they're ready to run the mile when we go. And, you know, it, it fosters what we're trying to promote in the schools, which is health and wellness and nutrition. Uh, the course that we're running today is a mile course around the Shana Kay track. We also have a parent run. Students will be out cheering for them as well. Um, we have a timing company that is here today timing the students. Each student has a, uh, a chip and a bib number to uh, really simulate a real race, um, give them that really true experience. Like I just like kept going, kept going. You do walk a little bit, got a minute, but if you, I think I did the same as this year and last year. It just feels good to be able just to run and get a healthy strength. My mom, she does the parent run, so um, I always want to try to beat her time. Um, so I hope I did. The kids at this age need to feel that they can set goals and they could attain their goals. So each year, coming in as a third grader, they'll have an opportunity to set a goal as a third grader and every year after that work toward um, accomplishing their goal and, and surpassing their goal from the year before. This year we were able to raise about $6,000. Um, some of those funds will be going toward the Make-A-Wish Foundation. In past years we've also been able to donate money to the Shana K Memorial Foundation um, and to the JDRF, the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation. So every year we've been fortunate enough to help put money towards a good foundation. Shana is our daughter who sadly passed away um, from viral encephalitis, a special virus that went to her brain seven years ago. And in her memory, we formed the foundation, which is like a company. And through donations from family and friends, we were able to raise money and give money back to the school system to do things that the school can use for their students. And one of the first things we did was offer money to Burr, and they formed this Shana K Memorial Track around the soccer fields, and that's what we'll be running on today. In doing these other projects for all the schools within the school system and the library, it enables us to keep her name around and makes us feel better because we don't have her physically to hold, but we have her name around the community and it makes us feel like she's still with us. We're here because we're part of the high school cross country team and we come out here because we love to run and we want to be with other people who are running and enjoying themselves. Oh, it was an awesome atmosphere. Everyone was so excited to be here and it was like in inspiring because all the little kids were just <laughs> trying their best and so excited to run this mile around the school building and all the parents did it and it was really like family oriented. Uh, the Make-A-Wish Foundation is going to directly um, help a child in the community who is struggling with an illness and our students are a part of granting their wish and making a difference in another student's life. They're um, going to be stronger and more caring and compassionate people for participating in a day like today. You know, it, it's wonderful. It makes us feel great. And it's interesting because of the projects we've done over the years, it's been seven years since she passed away. Um, she seems to be more popular now than she was when she was alive. <laughs> A lot of people know uh, her name and people even recognize us in the community who we never met before and even thank us for some of the projects that we've done. 